Ooh, hail and good morning to everyone. Welcome, welcome to the stream, guys. Hello. Oh, should I go big? Should I go big? We go full. I don't even know if I've got it all set up. Hello. Welcome to the stream. Thank you guys so much. Um, it's an earlier morning, uh, an unusual time for the art stream, but you know what? Uh, we're rolling with it. We're going with it. Uh, backup is uh, hanging out here. Uh, you won't be able to see him. <laughs> He's sleeping. He's sleeping. So I'm going to not be as loud today, uh, although I am rather loud. Um, we're going to be jumping into another Monster Manual art stream. That's right. And we're also going to be giving another piece of art away today. Um, and uh, yeah, we're going to get right into it. I am enjoying a, a, just a, a coffee right now. Uh, <laughs> uh, so <laughs> let, me, um, let, me, let me get back to the overhead screen here. Uh, this is the area that we're going to be doing our drawing. Uh, if you've never seen the channel before, uh, I usually do this every Wednesday. Uh, we do an art stream and I do some sketches uh, for you live uh, from start to finish. And uh, we've been basing the stuff off of the monster manual. Uh, just kind of give us a guide of where we're going. Uh, today, we're going to be doing the centipede and the centaur. Let me, uh, let me open up here. Uh, the, these are two monsters uh, that we're going to be doing today. Um, I don't know which one I'll start with, but uh, we're going to be jumping in there. It's going to be on an 8.5 uh, by 11 uh, piece of Bristol board paper that we're going to be doing. Uh, usually I do use, use mixed media. Um, so I've got a couple pieces of paper here. And... Uh, uh, you know, generally, I've been mixing it up, not starting with white paper, just because it makes it more interesting. <laughs> ah, I gotta wake up. Ah, uh, also, I gotta sharpen my pencils. Usually, I do this. Uh, oh, you know what? We need music. Let me let me throw on some music for you guys. Oh, how rude of me! Is that too loud? Can you hear it? I don't know if you can hear it. Let me turn it up a bit. I think you should be able to hear it. Let me know if you can hear the music. If not, I need to turn up the volume. <laughs> okay. Uh. Warm up the handsy poos. You can hear the music, okay. But is the music too quiet or is it at a nice level? Because uh, we want the nice level, right? We, we, don't want, we don't want it so that you're straining to hear it, but we also don't want it overpowering my voice. Ah, uh, okay. All good level? Okay. I need a, I need a second concurrent. <laughs> If I get two people saying it's good, then uh, then I know it's good. <laughs> Sometimes it depends on somebody's um, somebody's volume, right? So which one are we gonna do first? Let's find out. I'm gonna roll the dice. We're gonna do the centipede or the uh, centaur first. Fourteen evens. All right. Well, we're gonna do the centipede first. <laughs> that works. Makes my decisions easy. All right. Uh, horizontal. Vertical. I'm gonna do vertical. Verticals tend to look better um, sometimes on the streams and whatnot. So, okay, let's get to some sketching. Let's, um. Wow, wow, wow. Good morning, Suki! Good morning, how are you? Suki, um, I need to ask you, because <laughs> are my audio levels okay? Is the music. At a nice level. <laughs> Suki does a, a, a number of music streams. She's got a pretty good, uh, good idea. Oh, you're still that sleepy? Oh, no worries. No worries. I am streaming a little bit earlier than normal. We're going to be doing a uh, centipede right now. 
giant centipede, I should mention. It's a giant centipede. Maybe I should have put that in the title. <laughs> it's a giant centipede. Uh, it's not just a centipede. And... Let's see. Here. Something like that. That. I, right now, you guys can't see what I'm drawing. Because it's... it's I go super light just to give myself a little bit of a an idea of where things are. Let's start. Where do we start with the centipede? Should we start with a, 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 a small little head? Or you know what we could do? Hey, Emma! Hello, welcome. <laughs> welcome. Guys, we're gonna be, um, volume is good, five by five. Ooh, using the old uh, five by five reference. From uh, Buffy. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, okay. Hail to you guys, too. For sure. We say hail to each other on the channel. It's kind of our, our formal slash informal greeting. We like we like to hail the legendary tales of everyone. Um, that's kind of the theme of the channel. Um, we shout out hail to each other. Um, because we... We... we we hold each other up. That's the that's that's the idea. All right, let me um let me see if I can get something going here. Um Doing good. Uh, I'm I'm hoping that backup will be uh completely chill today. He had a rough day yesterday. Um, and so I couldn't in good conscience uh, do a stream uh, when he needed my attention. So I um, hope you guys will forgive me. But you know what? I figured let's try the let's try an early morning stream and uh, see how it goes. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to do I'm thinking like the end claw or the end of the tail, so to speak. Uh, on centipedes, generally have like a big kind of claw, but why don't we have it like be dangerous, dangerous claw? I'm thinking, let's do something like that. Weird to have like horns or teeth on the claw. I'm trying to think, I'm trying to make it more dangerous. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to do. More monstrous, actually. Oh, no problem. Like I said, so yeah, I wasn't able to stream. And so it was just kind of like, I wanted to hang out, you know, hang out with my peeps. And thank you, by the way, Suki, for posting in my Discord that you were going to be going live. Because that's, uh, honestly, uh, most of the time, how I get to know. <laughs> um, so I appreciate that, big time. <laughs> Let me see. And uh, so... Just, uh, and then it works, right? It lets me know. Um, I mean, I, if you're on DLive or whatever, I, I can't, uh, I can't rely on the sidebar. So, yes, it, it, it does work. <laughs> it's not in vain. <laughs> All right. You forgot to post in yours. Oh, no. <laughs> Suki, what we need to do actually is we need to um, we need to uh, get you to change uh, uh, on your server. There's a, something that you can actually add, which is like a um, making it a community server. Once you agree to do that, then you could actually make a an announcement channel. And once you have an announcement channel, you can then hit publish, and anybody who's following your channel, it will automatically publish 
whatever you posted in their server. And that makes your life a lot easier um, and gets your the word out a lot a lot a lot more. It's like a spider web, right? So um, it's incredibly useful. There's a number of people that have started to do it. I love it because it just it uh, it's it's a it's a really effective way of uh, letting letting people know, and it makes it easy because it's just one push of a button and it lets all the other servers know, um, which is really cool. You might actually see in some of the the Discord that says like that's from a server. Yeah, yeah. Emma, Emma knows. She's been she's all been all about it. <laughs> I finally got Cam to do it. Uh, you don't have many followers in your server. Well, you have no followers in your server because there there's no um, there's no announcement channel. Because on the announcement channel, that's how you follow it, right? It's it means anybody on any server that exists in Discord can click on that and follow the channel. Um, I mean, of course, yes, it would mean. They have to have access to the server, right? But, but yeah, we'll, we'll do it. Oh yeah, let's. Okay, I've got, I've got, a, I've got. This looks like a big giant lobster claw, doesn't it? <laughs> All right, we're we're gonna be building this up here, um, roughly. Spikes. Yeah. Listen, we're just, we're here to help each other. And forgive me for being forward. I just want to be, I just want to, I want to take a more active role in helping, helping others. Just because people have helped me and I want to return the favor. You've been you've been wanting to draw that vampirella or that vampira oh i thought why did i say vampire well that you know vampirella right oh i appreciate you suki yeah i just i sometimes i i what am I trying to say? I I feel like sometimes it's not. I, I don't want to ever be pushy, right? Like I don't want to ever anybody thinking you know like I'm trying to tell them what to do or anything like that. And that's that's not that's not. I just want to. Sometimes people take um, help that's offered as criticism, and that's no way. That's not not that's not what I'm trying to do. <laughs> Yes, yes. Vampire is the old OG scary movie house. That's right, that's right. I was thinking, I was thinking Vampirella from the comic, right? <laughs> He's got quite the skippy outfit. The outfit that almost defies gravity. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna have this guy like bending. Kind of all the way down here, thinking this is almost borderline scorpion. But I, well, you know what? I'll put many, many, many legs on. That's what I'll do. Okay. Uh, centipedes, centipedes. Let's see. We're gonna go with a centipede that has like a little, little, little head, little head. You know what I want to do? I want to have I want to have this guy creeping up on another adventure. I've been actually liking adding um, adventures to everybody's the, host the drawing. Elsa's channel. Oh, hosty host, little hosty host there. Thank Elsa. you. Appreciate that. Let me um. Let me 
add points for that. I know, you guys are like, why are you adding points? Well, you know, well, I'll come up with something. I'll come up with something for the reason for these points. We used to do the challenges, and we're taking a break from the challenges. Vampira Malia Numari posed for Disney and was the model for Maleficent. Ooh, little trivia there from Suki. <laughs> cool. I did not know that. I did not know that. Okay. Let's see. Little, little, we're going to have the little face here. Little face? I don't know. It's going to be like... um. You know, like the little mandible claws on a, on a on a centipede. I guess ish. I don't know. I really don't know what to do for the face for it. Centipedes don't really have like huge mouths or anything like that. I mean, this is a monstrous centipede, but I gotta figure out what's happening there. Oh yeah, Suki, if you ever need help publishing a sticker or whatever, I can, I can certainly do that for you. Okay, let's see. Need a little adventure here. Um, let's see. Let's do a little, little face. I'm thinking of having like the other, the other, um, the other tentacle coming up and around, like goes around here, and like now this is antenna, right? So I'm gonna have it kind of coming up and around and into the face of the. Uh, of the unsuspecting adventure. Oh, ha. And then we need a we need a surprise face, right? Side. <laughs> okay. Let's have, let's have, let's have like a, um, let's have like a chest or something like that, that this person was opening. Let's do like a, a chest. Let me put this away. Which movie? Everybody's the, hosting Elsa's movie? channel. Bingo Hell. The hosty host Bingo there, Hell. Elsa. You've seen Bingo Hell, but you didn't like it? Oh, thank you, Emma, for the hosty host. Much love. Thank you for that. That helps us get on the front page because this is the only way people are going to find us on DLive, guys, is if we hit that front page. If we don't hit it, no one's going to even come into the stream. Um, boom. Emma, thank you so much for this. Whoops. All right. Let's see, opening up this 
chest, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> this is kind of weird. All right. So we've got, we've got a little, a little Elsa's adventure here. Channel. Oh, Elizabeth, the host 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 there, Elsa. <laughs> Thank you, host host. All right. Gives you those points as well. <laughs> okay. Oh. oh, these lights are really bright. Oh my god. Put on some. There we go. You uh disappointed you can't host from your phone anymore? Really? So okay, if you type um exclamation point host. And then, and then space at, and then just put Elsar. It should work. That's a dev command on DLive. So just hit exclamation point, host, and then space at, and then Elsar, and uh, it should work. It should work. If you put that in your your own chat of your own channel, it will work. That's how you do it. Is you actually have to put it in your channel. So that's designating that it's your channel that's hosting. Nowhere on DLive does it tell you how to do that, by the way. That's, that's... <laughs> oh, is it the exclamation point post won't, won't work if you're not sub to tidy? Is that it? It's only a, it's like a, a perk for Tidylab subscribers? Is that it? Give it a try. Um, if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Then we know that you that it's it's yeah. Uh, okay, I didn't see that's the part I didn't know. I didn't know if it didn't work. You know all these useful things that would make D Live better, right? Make it make everybody be able to do it. The benefit for the community, benefit for the platform. But it's tidy sub only. Well, yeah. Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> All right, we're gonna do some uh, some 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 legs. Get some legs going. So we're going to do legs. We're going to go legs all the way up this side. Maybe a little bit on this side as well. I think. Uh, I'm going to do it for each section, right? Network. I'm sorry. centipedes and stuff like that, millipedes and all that kind of stuff. It's like, they have lots of legs, right? That's got to be a standard. They can't be legless. So I'll just mark kind of like where the legs are going to go. Oh, don't, don't be sorry. No, no, no worries. Like, should the legs just kind of like get smaller and smaller? I don't know. We'll see. It'll be if it drinks too much. <laughs> that is true. Looking. 
That's pretty gross looking. Okay, and we're just sketching this out. We're going to go in with some shading and stuff like that and really pop this out. I think what we'll do is we'll maybe... I like I kind of like this circular movement, so we'll actually make this kind of in a cave, maybe. And have, like, cave walls. And I can kind of make this maybe in the darkness, coming out of the darkness. Um, and then there should be light coming from the chest. The chest is, like, glowing. Think of, like, Pulp Fiction, right? Pulp Fiction... You open up the briefcase and it's got this orange glow or whatever. That's kind of maybe what we should do here is um Yeah, we'll mark we'll mark we'll do some lighting on this face. That's what we'll do. And then the cave could have some light in the background. And that way it kind of makes it seem like it's uh there's a light source or something. So we'll do a cave here. What's, what is in the briefcase? What, do, what is your theory of what was in the briefcase? Because <laughs> it was left up to the, you know, audience's interpretation, right? Everyone's going to have, like, a different idea. What would be in the... Like, is it something valuable? Is it something... Like, it's, it's supposed to represent... Um, what is it supposed to represent? Sin? Greed? What? Like, it's... It's, 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 it's actually works so much better... So much better that they don't identify what it is, right? But it caused a lot of problems. This is kind of a focal point, right? So we gotta bring some light over there. Um, okay, I pretty much sketched where everything is. Now we just need to. Uh, this is gonna be a chest, right? So we're gonna have to put some things around the edges of the chest. Although, actually, I might even put it in darkness, to be honest. It might work better in the dark. Light's coming from it. Okay. okay. Woo! Well, we live in the age of streaming now, Elizabeth. Uh, owning physical media is almost kind of something in the past. I've always loved owning physical media. That's something that I've um, I was like, oh, see, look how that dark that goes. Okay, cool. Let's see how this goes. We're going to have little beady eyes, legs. It's going to dry lighter. Okay. It's an interesting effect when you do um, a gray gonna do these kind of ridges here so we've got a little bit of a guide yeah I don't really play well I mean I guess sometimes you're faced with no choice they don't, they don't there's not a blu-ray for everything right so sometimes uh, and I prefer blu-rays over DVDs obviously I think anybody would but um, there's a lot of, there's a lot of films out there that have not been transferred to, to, to DVD or sorry, to Blu-ray. Um, so this is super light. That's what I'm realizing right now. So we're gonna go a little bit darker. I always get, I always get like nervous about going too dark right off the bat. Cause once I like, I, there's no undo button here, guys. When I put it down, that's it. <laughs> okay, so we have a little adventure first. I got, I want to make sure that this face uh, comes through. So let's let's focus on that first. We're going to have this kind of in darkness. I'm starting with like a medium tone so that I can go either light or dark, depending on what we do here. Um, okay, so let's see. Got to have a look of surprise on the face. So let's do that. 
Face focus. Focus that face. Face in the nose. This, is, this might end up looking a little cartoonish, but so be it. Chin. And then obviously there'll be a mouth here. Eyes of surprise. Oh, Elizabeth, you should uh, check out Sookie's stream. Then she's been doing. Um, she's been covering some uh, some really cool, cool films. And I love Sookie's little um, uh, your overlay that you set up with a uh, drive-in theater. I thought that was awesome. <laughs> Very creative. Okay. So we're gonna have a we're gonna have this kind of a shadow here. right now, huh? That's where that's where the film is. <laughs> What's up, back up? You okay? What's wrong? You okay, buddy? Try to move and you hurt yourself? Lay down, lay down. Lay down. He's got hip, full hip dysplasia, guys, so he's, um, he's real trouble walking, and I don't know, sometimes he, sometimes he wakes up and forgets where he is, uh, and he freaks out. I don't have to be. Okay. Let's go with a chest. And I don't know what kind of hat I put on him. I just put it like he's like wearing a big duke. <laughs> Alright. And then the caves. That gonna be I'm gonna add a little bit of a, a background here. Just kind of frame this a bit. Got a is a is a has an app 
And that's our recite. Oh, you, you dropped Netflix? Is that what you did? You said, yeah. It got, it got cut from the budget. Understandable. With prices rising and stuff like that. Pretty much, pretty much. Okay, it's a dark. We're, you know what? We're gonna go dark here too. Let me um. This guy kind of coming out of the darkness as well. Put in some some darker darker points. out here for ourselves. Cool. And then, there's, and then there's gonna be spikes and stuff like that on it too. Okay. Looking good. Um do I go light here with this? Just some light light stuff in the background. Elsa, I hope oh, you like ice cream. Oh my gosh. You got one. Hey, hey Fee, how you doing? Good morning! Doing a, doing a centipede right now, attacking an adventure. <laughs> Alright, so far so good. We, we'll probably go darker here, just to pop it out. But I'm just putting a base for myself right now. Um, and just kind of, just kind of like laying down some oh snap yeah this is about to get snapped by this giant giant freaking uh tail cannabis very finally sitting on my porch table when the mail lady came up <laughs> I don't know. We're I'm I'm in Vancouver. That is commonplace. Like no one even bats an eye. Um, one thing I love about Canada. It's completely decriminalized. It's no big deal here. <laughs> Alright, so what we're doing is we're laying in a little bit of texture. Um, this this is drying a lot lighter than I wanted, but that's okay. I can go a little bit darker. I need to give it some sort of volume or some sort of uh, sense of texturing on this. It's common, but you never know. Uh, yeah, I mean, there are, there are... I want to always respect people's wishes, but I mean... Hey! Do you raise the fam? How you doing? We're doing another giveaway today. Okay. Uh, I need to. I need to put in like at least some form of. 
color. Um, again, we want to pop this out a bit. So everybody's Whoa. hosting Elsa's channel. Hey, the host. Little wins. hosty host there, Elsa. Thank you for the host. Alright, so I'm thinking of going darker here. Darker around the side. So, maybe really dark. What am I painting? Uh, we are we are doing a giant centipede, a giant centipede. That is the uh, that's what's happening right here. There's a big tail. I know it's hard to see, guys, but I'm I'm starting to get there. <laughs> well, considering I'm only doing centipede and centaur today, I'm on C. <laughs> so I'm not very far through the alphabet yet. <laughs> D-Live. D-Live never works. Oh my god. Alright. It's the only platform that doesn't seem to want to wanna listen. I I the, the picture's not saved, anything's not saved. I've clicked save three times. What the hell? Alright. Let's do it again. Let's do that. Let me do that. I will fix it again. I'll put the picture in again. Thank you for letting me know. I appreciate that. There we go. Fix that. somebody just self-promoting in the channel yeah that's not uh, let me teach you a lesson it's not how you do it you'll never network that way you'll never get anyone doing dropping a link in a channel ever so you're doing it wrong the way you the way you network is you you make connections with people that's that's how you network all right i think it's saved i'm gonna hit refresh on it just to double check it again it didn't save. It's not saving, guys. So, is d -Live broken again? Can I not save the title? What the hell? I'll do it again, Art. And I'll drop the picture in again. Yeah, it's completely broken. I can't even save it. What the hell? Yeah, sorry guys. Uh, D Live's broken. I can't. Uh, I can't. <laughs> it's just ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, I am on Twitch, I am on YouTube, and I am on Trovo, so there are, there are always options. <laughs> I hit refresh again, and I bet you it's going to reset. Yeah, it's completely reset. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
Let's try this again. There we go. Yeah, it's not saving. Yeah, the way the way I've always found is uh, if you hang out, get to know people, uh, you end up becoming you know uh, acquaintances, friends, and stuff like that. Then you start start getting into like the self promotion, and that's how you that's how you you make a lasting impression and a lasting contact. Um, and it's a way for you to grow because it's about community. It's about growing your community. It's not just about getting a view. It's not about getting a like. Uh, it's, it's, there, there are, you gotta think bigger picture, right? Um, I mean, we're all, we're all in the same boat, right? Like, we're, we're all trying to, uh, you know, improve and, and get better and whatnot. But there are things that work and things that don't. Um, it's the same thing with uh, people that just go into discords and drop a self-promotion thing and don't interact with the Discord at all, uh, it doesn't work. All right, I'm just trying to put in some shadows here to bring this guy up. Uh, ah! Lens. Thank you, Lens, for the, the creepy. <laughs> but you know what? It's, it, I think everybody makes that mistake at first, right? I think it's it's over time that you get to know, ah, oh, what are the do's and don'ts, right? Um, and it's just, you know, like when everybody starts out streaming or, or just starting to make, you know, just starting out, it, I think I think we've, we've all been there, right? We've all done that mistake. We've all, all um, But uh, it's you start you start to realize what's more important, right? And that's making connections with people. <laughs> okay, I okay. I'm kind of like giving us kind of like the a little bit of room for the for the um. Let's see here. Yeah, we'll have to send a ticket. For, for D Live, although I'm pretty sure somebody's already experienced that. Might be already in the Discord. Thing that's going to disappear on D Live is uh, the replays, right? Like, that's going to be the next thing to go. <laughs> There'll be no more replays. Oh, uh, what happened? This closed down? What the heck? majority of you are still on the platform so there that that does mean something right a, a, a majority of you are are in like if you look at my chat it's all d live um i mean the, the, the thing i don't like about things like twitch is the, the the obnoxious ads and advertisements nobody likes that
But I would tolerate ads on DLive if it meant improvements to the platform. <laughs> I also think it's just habit. <laughs> True. It's where where most of us met, right? Okay. That here we go. I want this in shadow too. My gosh. Warframe became X tag? What do you mean? <laughs> How did Warframe become X tagged? really naughty <laughs> hey death thinker how you doing oh you guys were telling dirty jokes got it got it that explains everything <laughs> okay yeah so I'm putting in a little bit more things for the cave Naughty? Oh my. Hey, Lady Crochet. How are you doing? Elsa, someone just Whoa. subscribed to your channel. How oh, are you going to street. react? How? How? Sure. I'm happy your your audio issues got sorted out too. I know. I'm glad. I'm glad everything worked out. All right. Okay. So I'm slowly building up this cave, um, trying to frame this thing. And we're kind of having this thing kind of in the shadows as well. Wanted it kind of coming out of the shadows. But this unsuspecting adventurer is getting attacked. Um, okay. Now, let's see what we're going to do. We're going to... Where do I start? Do I start with the adventurer or do I start with the tail? Let's start with the adventurer. I'm going to go a little bit darker here on this edge with this hat, I guess. It's a hat. And then uh, this is, I guess, an ear. A face. Let's 
put a more defined shadow here, shall we? Did you lose a day? <laughs> oh yeah, normally normally it's our stream on Wednesdays. Um, unfortunately, backup needed some extra attention yesterday. I was not able to stream in good conscience. Uh, I just, he was having a real bad day today, or yesterday. Today, he seems better. Uh, he woke up in a really good mood, and um, I don't know. It's it's. I was gonna try and do it late last night, but then it just it didn't work out. So. Well, Fury, do you have any art advice for me? Because I'm not improving at all. Um. What what kind of art do you do, Well, Fury? I mean, there's there's exercises you can do that will help improve. Uh, I mean, it depends on what 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 stage you're at in terms of uh, your learning. So, um, a lot of times, drawing things with just shapes is the first step. Ah, anime and graffiti. Um, yeah, so anim anime and graffiti are stylized versions of, um, of of things, and you can you can you can lock yourself into um it's hard it, you can you can what's the best way to describe it it's kind of like they are a stylized version of let's say you know if you're drawing something in real life you can take that and make it more anime or chibi or 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 um you know funky or comic book style right by overemphasizing and changing changing things in a dynamic way um, but a understanding of, of life, drawing first, is kind of paramount, right? You have to have a base, because you're going to do a stylized stuff based off that. Um, a lot of times with a lot of anime stuff, a lot of people just copy what they see of other anime, right? You know, draw an eye like this, draw, draw something like that. Um, and so my, my, my advice would be to try, to try to do as much life drawing as possible, to be honest. Um, starting to look at things like shadow, and light, and, uh, and shapes. Try drawing things with nothing but lines, line weights, right? Thicker means closer, thinner, almost disappearing is in the background. Um, there's a lot of different things you can do that, that, will, that will help develop your, your knowledge. Because the whole point is to communicate something from you know in your head to paper right so it's um but looking at a lot of uh life stuff will really really help so um that's like the fundamentals of drawing uh my background comes from uh, a basis in fine art, and then I did do comic book work as well. So I, I've done both graphic graphic art and um, more art that's more about self discovery. So, all right. So we're gonna go. You know what? I'll go darker here. I don't know if that reads as dark here, but yeah. I'm, so you see, I'm kind of building this up. So what I'm doing is I'm thinking of the light sources coming from the chest. The way I make that light is I keep this really bright and I'll make the chest actually dark. Uh, if I do that, it'll really pop it out, I think. Well, but Wolf Fury, I appreciate the question, honestly. I wish I had a more kind of definitive answer for you, but um, put it this way, the more you draw, the more mistakes you make, the more you're going to learn from it, right? Like, and that's the whole point. Like, 
no art is ever going to be perfect. And, you, you know, a lot of times, especially with non-digital art, it can be really helpful because you can't undo what you've done, right? You have to work with, like, if I make a mistake here, I got to work it into the drawing. Uh, whereas digital, a lot of digital work, I'm not going to say it's a crutch, but it's, it's, there's so much safety in it. There's so much safety. It takes a long time to do, but there's a lot of safety involved. And the thing, the thing about art is about being fearless, about taking those chances, about, yeah, it's, it's, really good art is just being bold and just going out there and do it like it's it i think i think you understand what i'm saying <laughs> but yeah and we all could i mean i heck i can you i can i need to draw more <laughs> Yes, yes. Um, art will never be perfect. There's no such thing. All right, we're gonna go dark here. I can maybe do it with pen. Might be better. Hey, Jelbean. Hey, Jelbean, how you doing? Uh, I don't know if I'm talented, but I, I have a really strong work ethic. How about that? Oops, see, look at that. I almost like wrecked the drawing. All right, so we got that, this guy here. I'm gonna be putting in some lights and stuff like that too, which will help emphasize it. I kind of want to really pump up the, so I'm, this is kind of funny here because it's like, he's got an, an antenna going right in front of his face. Oh, thanks, Jimmy. Then, okay, we're gonna go darker here with the, the chest as well. This is like the lid. And then it's gotta get really dark on this side, right? Because that's, there's no light. If light's coming from the chest, the opposite side is gonna be super, super dark. So we're gonna have to go really dark with that. Um, let's see what I mean. I'm just gonna go right off the paper there. Boom. Um, I might even go dark all the way, but let's 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 play with it first. Let's let's do maybe halfway here. And I can go like a slightly lighter kind of right above it. And we might block that all in. Because the viewer's gonna know what, what, what it is. Emphasis has got to be on this part, not that part. So it kind of frames it in a way. If it was not for YouTube, you would have not known that I was live. That is that is a common story that's been happening. Um, Karen, are you not in my Discord? Or... Do you, I, 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 a lot of times, a lot of people turn notifications off. I tend not to use at everyone and stuff like that a lot. But... Um, or, Karen, are you on Twitter at all? Okay. There we go. Uh, just so you know, uh, uh, Wolf, are, I don't, I don't know if you're still in the, in the channel or whatever. I do have a Discord too. Um, I'd be happy to answer questions in a more written format um, if you have art questions at all. I would love to, I'd love to be able to respond to that. Um, hey, it doesn't. I don't think it works, Death Thinker. I've tried that. I've tried that with numerous channels. Like, if I look at my sidebar right now, 
It's... It's the same five people. And that's it. And I've, I've gone through my entire list and, like, tried to unfollow and follow, and it, do it doesn't seem to be working. I don't know. We gotta roll it back. Roll back to an earlier build, D-Live. Oh, no problem. All good. You're welcome anywhere. Okay. We got that. That works. Uh, let's see. All right. Boom. Let's. Okay. What are we gonna do here? We're gonna. We're gonna. Bring, should we bring in the lights already? Should we do that? I need to sharpen my pencil if that's the case. Stedler, what do I want here? Let's grab our pencil crayon. So we've got we've got a light light here. How is this gonna look? Okay. I'm gonna have like two antennas curving around here. Okay, not alright. Maybe a little bit of light. Let's do some light to define the shape here. Light coming from this. Let's light, let's light it up. So obviously the chin would be the most lit up, right? Elsa, I hope you like ice cream because you got one. Another creepy, really? <laughs> Elsa, I hope you like ice cream because oh, you got appreciate one. The, appreciate the love, friends. Thank you. Could come at a better time too. I need it. I'm like my lemons are like almost gone. <laughs> Music just die. There we go. I got it back. I got it back. Okay. Do a little bit of light maybe coming from that shoulder. That might be good. Okay. It's back! The music is back! Woo! Uh, idea. <laughs> Look at that face. Ah! <laughs> hey, Green Warden, how you doing?
uh, Jobain, the re one of the reasons why uh, Linz is on Twitch is because her DLive is not working. Oh, I appreciate the love, guys. Thank you. That is true. They are mods. Yeah. light here just to find the shapes okay so and then I'm thinking kind of like a little bit of extra light here really what the Trovo is offline now it says it's streaming no it says it's on According to me. I'm at, I can go, oh, let me go to the actual channel. The stream is having a lot of problems right now. Yeah, no, it says your shows I'm live. Yeah, this, yeah, I'm live. Fresh lens. <laughs> All right. Cool. All right. So if that's the case, there we're gonna do like a bit of a light source happening here. Oh, don't worry. All good. Blend it out though. You have coffee. Nice. A light source coming in the distance there. We'll work it out. We'll work it out. Alright. So I need to define this. Let's 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 just go in here with pen. We're gonna do some uh, kind of teeth, like 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 thin claws, or, or like kind of like um yeah, they're gonna look a little bit like teeth, I guess. Horns. Kind of like that. See, look at that. I screwed up. Damn it. Let's see if I can blend that out. I will blend it out. My, see, my hand smushed it. We'll incorporate it into the drawing, right? That's what we'll do. No one would even notice. <laughs> All right. Let's that. Power kind of thing in the background. I play with it. Make it kind of like a stalactite. What is it? Stalactite? Stalagmite? One's up top and one's at the bottom, right? Uh, 
Lots of caves. Hey, is can anybody check? Is there is there anything in the Discord that is talking about um, the fact that that people can't save the information? For the stream, when you're setting up your stream, yeah, guys, that would help me out huge if you could if you could uh, drop a like or sub on uh, on on YouTube. I'm trying to get to 500 um, subscribers. Once I get there, I can actually do. Um, it opens up a whole different community tab for me, and it will definitely. It will definitely uh, open up a lot of options and, and it will help a huge way. My favorite subject to draw when I was an adolescent. Adolescent. I'm still an adolescent in many ways, in shape and form. Um, I mean, I'll be honest with you, probably sexy ladies. <laughs> that's, that's, that's probably... Like that's that's what I always drew in comic books and whatnot. Uh, I think we're in like three three thirty one or something like that on YouTube right now. Um, at the beginning of the year we were at eighty, so it's it is it is growing. So that's good. Um, and I, I'm starting to focus on YouTube a little bit more. I still need to produce more videos. I, I've I just, uh, I've been so busy with stuff, um, and I'm, I'm trying to, uh, trying to get better with editing and stuff like that. I'm still learning right now, so a lot of my videos that I'm working on right now are not published, uh, because I'm learning about different editing techniques and stuff like that. So it's, um, you know, but once I get that, that down, then I'm going to be able to actually start producing things at a much faster rate. Um... What am I doing? <laughs> Bobby, do you like my sexy lady face? What? <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, I, to be honest, Suki, like when I used to draw, like as a kid, what influenced me the most um, was I would I would draw. Uh. I think, I don't know. I, I was always influenced by TVs and movies. Um, I reproduced what I saw on television and movies on paper. So things that were a huge impact on me, Star Wars. I drew ships and battles and things like that. Superman, I would draw Superman a lot. Uh, E.T., E.T. was a big thing that affected me. I was at that right age. Um, you know, where it hit me big time emotionally. And so I, you know, it, it, I went through phases. Uh, I drew Battlestar Galactica um, a lot. Um, there was a lot of things that I see on TV and or, or, or movies. Um, and I would just constantly draw it over and over and over and over again. Um, yeah, I, I don't know. We're gonna do some All hail ah! the new follower on Elsa's Marks channel. One. Woo! Thank you for hitting that that follow button. Much love. Come on in the chat, say hi. Let's love to get to know you. <laughs> Man, that alert's loud. Okay. Try to get some defining shape on this claw here. Um, maybe, you know what, we'll do. I'll save this, because sometimes this just gets a little loud. We're going to go with pencil crayon. No one said anything about it? Then what is my issue? Man.
Yeah, it's not saving for me. I can't save it. And you know what? What upsets me even more is that you can't edit it afterwards either. I can't go back and, and change it after the fact. Um, I can't change the picture and I can't change the description. Like, just basic editing would be amazing. But yeah, it's not it's not saving for me. I'll try again before the end of the stream. But uh, yeah, it doesn't seem to be working. It's funny, the search tag thing's back, too. Or the additional tags that you can put on. Um, I wonder if maybe because nothing's selected, maybe that's that's possibly why it's not saving. Let's, let's try just a... What do I do? IRL? Let me see. Search that okay. I did that. I did that. I did selected art for the category. Um, but yeah, it's not letting me, it's not letting me save. Hold on. Maybe, maybe that'll work. Okay, take care. Much love. Thank you for thank you for for dropping by. Okay, let me refresh it and see if it works. Ah, I think it worked, guys. I think it worked. So, I had to I had to actually select a um Unrelated tag. Because <laughs> there's no art tag. It should it should be changed now. Oh wait, it didn't change. Shoot. <laughs> Just checked. I hit re re uh, refresh. Does it still say Sea of Thieves? Yeah, it still says Sea of Thieves. Man. Yeah, it's not working. I'm not gonna waste any more time on it. All hail you Whoa! On El Star's channel. Thank, you. thank you so much for the follow. <laughs> much love. I appreciate that. <laughs> um. Yeah, this this is it's broken. Oh, thank you. Appreciate that. Uh, Death Thinker, also let me know. I, I I don't know if you're in my in my Discord or not, um, but I do have a place there where you can you can um, you can promote your promote your stuff, as well as it um, allows us to kind of share links and stuff like that. And definitely uh, support you on different pl platforms that way. Right. Okay. All right, we've got some. <laughs> just figuring, figuring out where where everything's going here. All right, little spikies on the end there. I need to define this whole. The whole idea is to do the centipede, right? We need to define this guy. I've been doing everything else except what I'm supposed to be doing. Get in here and drop in some um, little shadows. This would be shadowed on one side. Again, we wanted to have them kind of come out of the dark darkness too. Ah, how was your shower? <laughs> I 
You don't have to give us details, it's okay. <laughs> in there thinking we're gonna go I need to define this guy a little bit more so I'm thinking we're gonna go in with a pen and do it let's see what pen do I want to use oh nice awesome welcome aboard <laughs> Alright, let's let's start. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start with this corner. Because I can I'm I'm noticing that I'm smudging a lot because I'm kick, I'm focusing on this side and not not that side. So we're gonna go in here. Let's keep defining this um this tail. And we're gonna pop everything out by adding a little bit more of a, a little bit more line weights, I guess. That's what I, what I wanna do. Have this kind of claw coming up. Uh, that's right, Elizabeth got a, a Baby Yoda toy. Yeah, it's black coffee. It's nothing but black coffee there, um, because uh, we're doing uh, we're doing a little bit of uh, intermittent fasting right now. We're, we're doing a, a nice uh, little forty-eight hour fast. So I do I do have water here with uh, filled with electrolytes. So um, so I can do coffee, but I can't put cream in it. Um, and I never put sugar in my coffee, so, but, but, uh, normally I put cream. I put a uh, cream in the, in the, in, in my coffee, but, uh, not allowed to do that. But, uh, as of tonight, I'm going to have dinner and it's going to taste so good. <laughs> Uh, the reason why I do fasting, you're probably asking, is, is uh, for health reasons. Um, uh, it's part of uh, part of ketosis and being able to kind of repair damaged cells. And then um, the other thing also is budget. <laughs> you uh, food is damn expensive now. <laughs> so uh, backup's chilling. He's he's sleeping right now. He's, uh, he's behind me. He seems to be doing okay. Uh, he was not doing great yesterday, uh, which is why I didn't stream. But it's not, not, uh... I gotta remember that streaming is, 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 is a luxury in a way. Um, and, uh, yeah, he, uh, he needed attention, so... Uh, let's see. We're gonna add a little bit more definition here with some. What I'm doing is I'm doing some kind of almost like pointillism, right? Where I'm kind of wanting to show that there is a um, a texture to it by adding just little markings and stuff like that. It, 
he basically will get like a little bit of a, a simulated texture, right? We don't have to do everything, but um, just because it's it is a uh, centipede and it's got you know kind of like a kitchen armor, so to speak. Uh, a lot, and so just by doing this, it adds like a, a little bit of a texture. So where there would be shadow. We've got like where the light goes in and out, um, and it kind of almost like a stucco, right? I think that might be a good, good way to to define it. it. Just takes a long time to do. That's the only thing that's always like, ugh. But this is a deadly claw, and <laughs> we need to emphasize fact that it is going to get this guy so uh, if you're just joining me fresh here uh, we are going to be doing an art giveaway here uh, I do have a wheel that uh, anybody who's in chat at the time when we start calling for it uh, you get a, you get an entry to win of course, if you're subbed to the channel on either Trovo, um, DLive, Twitch, you will, um, you'll get an automatic entry even if you're not here. And then I have a Patreon as well that allows you to get uh, additional entries. Uh, Patreon is probably the biggest way you can support uh, the stream. And uh, the more patrons we get, the more, more giveaways I can do. Right now... We've got seven patrons. Our, our goal is to get to 30. We want to get 30 patrons on the site. Now, Patreon, the way it's set up, I have tiers that give you extra benefits, um, but you can also define your own. In other words, if you want to create a number or whatever, it's, uh, it's, it's a pretty amazing platform that allows um, you to support a stream, and you know that the streamer's getting most of the... Of the of the donation, right? So, um, whereas like Twitch, you know, they take what, what, fifty percent? Uh, D Live, I believe, takes twenty five percent. Um, what is it for Trovo? I don't even know. I can't remember. I think YouTube, YouTube. Once you get monetized on YouTube, they take thirty percent. But. Uh, on, I believe on Patreon, I, I believe this, it's 92% goes towards uh, the person you're trying to support, so. <laughs> All right. That's not looking bad. I don't mind that. I like that. We're going to do a little bit more ridges here. We'll add a little bit more lines. Yeah. I don't mind that. And we'll do that well um the reason why i chose uh chose has unique rewards oh my unique god there's like, like you there's like an interest rate an ad going on right now let's, let's uh, get rid of that <laughs> there we go all right so the reason why i chose patreon is because it's 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 cross-platform right it doesn't matter what where you're watching or what or or what now i try to add a little bit more um benefits too there, a lot of times there'll be free art there'll be um exclusive uh early access to certain videos um and you see a lot of behind the scenes stuff too uh i've added to to the patreon so um trying to give gives what i like about it i think the most is it gives me more control to be able to give back to you as as a viewer um and that's kind of why we chose to go with patreon Hey, what lion? How you doing, buddy? How are you, bud? Yeah, we're. I know it's weird, right? Like, why am I on so early in the morning? And uh, on a on a Thursday, not a Wednesday. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I, all right. There we go. How you doing, White Lion? Whew. I'm I'm all right. 
I'm alright. I, um... I was kind of bummed yesterday, but I was, uh... I was a little worried about this morning with how backup was going to be, because he was... He needed a lot of attention yesterday, so... Tail, tail coming up. I might do some like spit lines or something like that, or like some sort of ooze or something like that, just to show it opening. I think that might be might be good. Um, let's define these these um, these legs. I think I gotta work the legs up here, uh, and I need to do a head as well. It needs to be a, a really defined eyeballs. These are the eyes. What? Emma, you just killed your back. What what the hell did he do? Emma's doing bench presses. What's going on? Oh no. Hovering, doing hover. Is that an, is that an exercise technique? Or is it like exercises you need to do? Hovering. What is hovering? Oh my god! Is that why? Why am I thinking of like planking? I, 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 what is hovering? Hoovering. Hoovering. Oh, like using like like a Hoover? As in like vacuum? Like a Hoover vacuum? Is that a thing called Hoovering? Is that a UK thing? I thought you said hovering. Sorry. Yes. Okay. It's a Hoover vacuum. Okay. I'm starting to put it together now. All right. You threw out your back vacuuming. God dang it. <laughs> the vacuum cleaner around. Oh. 